so you set up your online store on equid and you're looking to get in your gateway what is gateway basically where people pay when they go to check out so on the next um, page when someone buys any of your items they will land here and they need to actually use either paypal or checkout since we're in south africa they will check out when they do check out they will land on this page which is basically their details of where you're going to deliver their items then you go check out and uh, on the next page is basically where you need to set up your gateway so someone can actually um, have a delivery cost of how much their items in total will be this is the part where people get confused um, pay cash set that up and of course with uh, the credit or debit card or paypal so how do you set this up because a lot of people are very confused this will not show up unless you, you set it up that won't show up unless you set it up as well and uh, basically if they use credit or check account uh, debit account they will land over here this is what you want to get set it up it's called pay fast gateway I am going to give you all the documentations that you need how to register it and when someone hits this button or choose visa or whatever they're choosing to actually check out safely and you can get your money and get it started straight after this when the lights come on and they stop recording in the whole world now wants to hear your story hey. Toss it by the TV call All right, on the setup video, remember we spoke about uh, setting up your store and because it was a free store, I couldn't add more products because I needed to upgrade. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna click on this button and I'm going to take this 220. Um, I think it's 220, it could change, it could, but it won't be more than 200 and something, 10 or 11. So I'm just gonna check out and because I wanna add my, my, my more products, and I want to add my domain name and I want to add in um, what else do I want to add uh, there's some things that a, an upgrade can can do for me that my free store won't do and I need to do this in order to show you guys what it do what's up okay so now that I've paid you see they say thank you so much for paying uh, I just want to see and test out if I can actually add more products so I'm gonna go to products and there's the button it was frozen remember the last time uh, let me just test it out and uh, let me click on it and I can add more products um, yeah I can add more products which is delicious so now it is actually telling me that um, what I need to do is upgrade to my payment gateway what is a payment gateway I'm gonna explain it to you it's where it's like a, a mini bank for basically people who are like you and myself we want to sell online but we, don't, we can't accept people's credit cards and things like that because of safety reasons so uh, if you if someone goes in, in, on your site like this one the push and supply site and they want to order something they need to have a gateway they need to where they can enter their credit card or where they can enter um, their banking details so that you can actually get money but if you see what's happening right now that means that I haven't entered anything it will do that until until that's why some people are losing sales uh, and they say they don't have sales but people can't buy on their site because they don't have a gateway so I'm, I'm very confused of how you're gonna get sales if you if someone can't even check out anyway go to payfast uh, .z .z uh, or just type in payfast on Google and go to sign up when you get to sign up basically you're registering to be an agent an agent is what you are right so I'm already registered there's no need for me to do that so what you can do is choose a company or a company or an individual so what I suggest is that you choose individual if you don't have a CK but 
you know, I would say go and register for your C your your your, your C Pro and get a company registration because there's a lot of scamming that's going on and they're gonna prove you a little bit faster if you have those documentations. If not, use the individual one because what you are actually going to need, they're going to ask you for your key number and they're gonna ask you for basically your registration number, right? Your merchant number and your key number. So you're gonna go basically to settings uh and then what you're going to do is go to payments and w at payments you're going to go forget about paypal paypal no one uses paypal in south africa what we're looking for is actually the um third party which is either you're going to add in people who can pay at their atms at the atm and there you have to put in your banking details that's if payfast hasn't approved you yet so people who ever come to your to your store they can just um, use that to go and pay. Uh, some people pre prefer it because of all the scamming that's going on uh, online. Anyway, let's set up here, right? This is where we want it. We want people to get credit cards. Actually, it's this one here. My bad. It's this one, right? We're going to go all the way to pay fast and set it up, right? Choose click pay fast and then put in your, when you, once you get approved, they will give you your merchant number which is one that you can just copy over there and then you have to go and paste it where they ask you at Equid uh, Payment Gateway. They're going to ask you for that, just paste it over there and then go get your key number which is that one over there and click it and enter it over there. The, f the, the paraphrase, the past phase or paraphrase don't worry about that. Uh, as long as you got those two in, it should work, right? Um, what I've realized, it doesn't approve you straight away, so don't be scared. Uh, it's okay. So basically, your banking details that has to go over there. I am going to enter my banking details after this right here, but I need to actually cover this up because wow, guys, there's a lot that's happening. All right. While I'm, I'm still doing that, let me tell you a little bit. So what you're going to need, you're going to need your ID. You're going to need your CK. You're going to need your proof of residence. And uh, But what you can do when you go to PayFast is actually just call them and talk to a consultant. Their company, uh, what's this? Their information hotline is very, very good. I spoken to some guys I called them and then they picked up asked a few questions but it's very easy all you have to do is just submit because when you actually go and register with PayFast you have to just load in your um, your details and then after loading in your details they will just approve you or they'll call you if they have any problems other gateways like this another one pitch what what this Yaga this whatever unfortunately it doesn't work on this um, platform even with Shopify I don't think Shopify also has that um, integration so your best part is pay fast and pay fast pays you after 24 hours or three working days between three working days and 24 hours I like them because you know what I'm saying uh, if I have a lot of customers that have um, paid in and I've got orders worth of 30,000 it's a nightmare waiting for the money now after waiting for the money I have to get the products after paying I mean I have to pay the supplier the supplier it's quite a nightmare right so just make sure that you have all the documentations they get you approved and after 24 hours they're the I have never had a problem with them they pay me fast they're always on time I love pay fast all right so now that I've, I've set up my banking details this is for people want to pay cash to your deposit so if you go to the site uh, so if you go to the site, it's either they're gonna pay with PayFast or they're gonna pay with uh, the what's this? Uh, pay to your direct uh, deposit. So those are the two options that people are actually gonna get. Um, for PayPal, I would say set it up if you can, if you want to. But my PayPal, the reason why I'm setting it up is because people that pay on my PayPal, it goes straight to my bank account. So I but that's a bit complicated and I don't want to confuse you because you're just starting with drop out with drop out with drop shipping so but yeah I would set it up and just put in my email address and that one will be just easier so either way that I'm giving just people enough options not to log off 
without actually paying so it's as easy as simple next week we are talking about basically after you have your pay fast and stuff like that how do you get your first sale i think that's very very important so yeah it's very easy you check out and um, give it some time don't rush it because it might not work i'll see you guys uh soon yeah okay i hope that helps